right, another game of uh, bolt action. We're doing a thousand points. We're doing what's that mission that we're doing? Meeting engagement. Meeting engagement. <clears throat> we're at Wade's, and uh, here's this thousand points of uh, Canadians. So, what do you got? My Canadians are making their debut. I'm using uh, little ten-sided dice for my pin markers, but I have uh, basically a lieutenant and a, and a soldier with him. Uh -huh. uh, a forward air controller, the free artillery observer. Uh, everything in my army is regular. Yeah. Um, one eight-man section, one seven-man section, uh, three-man recce team, which are actually veteran. Sorry, they can only be taken as veteran. Okay. A Piat team and a sniper team, 25-pounder light howitzer, a reconnaissance variant of the Bren gun carrier, and, of course, a Churchill with petard mortar. Of course. Yeah, of course. I've got facing that uh, as well uh, I've got no, nothing that's veteran I've got my uh, 8 rad I've got uh, making its debut the 7.5 centimeter infantry support gun I've got uh, Panzer 3 I've got my sniper team as well uh, on the mailbox there I've got uh, an anti-tank uh, Panzer Bukes 41 uh, and a tank rifle. Really, realistically, the only tanks it's going to be shooting at is your uh, your recce thing. Um, my LT, <clears throat> and then I've got four identical squads of uh, grenadiers, each with an MG34 team, two SMGs, and two Panzerfausts. Um, because it's meeting engagement, we're just going to be doing advance orders. Uh, onto the board, with the exception, obviously, of the uh, both howitzers, which are going to have to do a run order to once to get on the board. So, uh, You've opted for this table edge here. Right. Um, you've kindly given me this my new building that I painted up last night <clears throat> and this morning. So you've kindly uh, left that open to me. I'll have to probably set, set fire to it with the uh, Avery <laughs> or blow it sky high. Because I think you can blow up the buildings, eh? Oh, you can. Oh. That's your goal. That's your sister goal. All right. Uh, we'll uh, start up and uh, see how the first turn looks. All right. Turn one. Um, we deployed our snipers ahead of time uh, and then started pulling dice out of the bag. Um, he deployed his sniper in that crop. Took a shot. Missed. I returned the favor. Hit and kill the sniper team and got rid of it right away. Uh, after that, um, just a bunch of run orders, to be honest. Um, I'm pushing my luck into here. I've got uh, two units. Uh, the red paint delineates. We felt this is big enough that it uh, should be split into two. So we've got uh, two platoons in there. Uh, my, rec or my eight rad did take... Some pot shots into those guys there uh, with the auto cannon would have been nice if I hit. Uh, <clears throat> I didn't hit, but I was able to score. Oh, well, you did hit. You oh no, I did hit. Casualties. Right? Yeah, yeah. Right, that's right. So because I hit, I was pins. able to do the yeah the D two pins, which worked out. Uh, his only return fire was uh, his air observer put in called in a air strike on here. Uh, his recce carrier and his Avery. Uh, are still in reserve, so I've given him a nice big target here, freshly painted building with two units in it. We'll see if he'll take the bait. <laughs> so on to turn two. Well, I think this sums up uh, pretty much turn one. Uh, at the start of the game, or turn one, his uh, air came in, the Spitfire came in, and uh, blew up my Panzer III. I actually caught set on fire, and then I failed my morale, and they ran. Uh, in other, yeah, from right there, uh, I was able to get a, a hit on it, but I, you need three hits to uh, to shoot it down. So I wasn't able my um, my eight rad wasn't able to get those hits in. Um, in other moves, um, we didn't have that that much actual fire. Um, he, I moved my um, anti tank rifle up to throw a pin marker on that section that I had moved up behind the tree line. He then brought in his, this is crazy, 70 points for two MMGs on that recce carrier. That's unbelievable. Um, LMGs. LMGs. Well, still, whatever. Yeah. That's still eight shots for 70 points. I mean, this is five shots for 100 points. 
I'm sure it's better armored. Uh, but he missed all of them uh, because he was on the move, um, and I was in the cover, so that was Small good. Team. Small team. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Uh, he called in the air observer. Artillery. Artillery. Sorry, artillery observer called in here. The howitzer, or his 25-pounder uh, oh, called in there. I, I moved up just to get shots off, uh, hoping that it doesn't range in next turn. Um, I've got my 7.5. Uh, not ranged in yet, but that's... So I'm hoping that I get first shot there. Um, I moved up here and was taking pot shots through there at the lads. Uh, these guys moved up from this building here, and I moved the sniper up so I can start hopefully picking off 25-pounder loaders. You know, as you do. Uh, his Avery tried to come on and failed the test. Uh, so that's the end of turn one. Um, I mean, I killed a sniper, but he killed my <laughs> Panzer three. So that's definitely a win uh, for Wade. Uh, we'll see what's going on. All right, a bit more action. Um, I know I want to do this. Bolt action is tough to film. Um, I did another run order over there because the hill was in the way of me sniping a 25 pounder loaders. These guys ran up to here. These guys advanced. Um, again, took shots at the squad that was there. There uh, took him a number of pins. He counter moved two small units and SMG'd uh, these guys here. Um, he sh killed the loader of my anti tank rifle. I passed my test, shot, and wasn't able to. Pipe off the um, the universal carrier. Uh, oh, his Avery took a shot. <laughs> Roll the one, not to hit, but for the armor. Uh, so basically, this armored plow in the front is basically wrecked because it just ate a petard shot. But he caused a number of pins on me. I've got how many on here? Just two. That seems to be low. I'm sure, it's more than that. Um, these guys advanced up to do some shooting. The Piat guy is down to one team left, um, uh, and his artillery failed to range in. Uh, my 7.5 failed to range in on his 25 pounder. His 25 pounder failed to range in here. So not that like no units were killed uh, in this round, but uh, onwards here we go. Well, uh, that went pretty well uh, for me. Once again, we'll go the other way now. The Avery once again hit, once again rolled a 1 to damage, so this armored plow here, paying dividends. I was up to 7 uh, pin markers, uh, which I was able to rally off down to 3. Uh, these lads moved up, declared Panzerfaust shots at the Bren gun carrier um, that went down, actually. He tried, to, he tried to give an order to move him, and he, he failed, so he went down. Uh, my Bren gun carrier, or I didn't hit the Bren gun carrier. The infantry were hitting this down. To, the Piet team also went down, uh, failed the order. I couldn't hit him. Uh, these guys moved up from here and assaulted that uh, section of five dudes, killed them all. Um, over here, uh, again, I got all my dice before him, so I did a snap two. Moved my commander up here, moved these guys up here, decimated the rest of the squad that was down there. He was down to commander and one lone SMG guy <clears throat> who then assaulted here, and I, he killed my aide, and I killed both of them. Uh, these guys had moved up and tried pinning them. Uh, the angry foo walked out. <laughs> With, with his uh, rifle or SMG? SMG. SMG picked off a guy, caused a pin. Uh, my sniper um, caused a pin. Uh, did I kill a guy? No. no. I just, but I caused a pin. Yeah, um, yeah he lost a ton of uh, stuff, and now we're going to do pro what's probably going to be the last turn. Uh, so, yeah, uh, fortune is for me. We'll do one more and see how it uh, shapes up. All right, the uh, final turn. Go cool, left to right. Sniper guy moved up just so he's chilling out in the uh, enemy field. There was nobody to shoot at him over there because my 7.5 uh, 
uh, unpinned. Or, yeah, he got Pass rid of the... Pi- he passed his order because uh, the Spitfire flew overhead and he took a pin. So he finally got rid of that, fired, blasted two of the three guys, and they failed their uh, test and ran. Uh, these guys moved up and point blanked into the foo uh, in that little wood line there. Uh, this guy, the lone CO guy, was going to try and move over here and to improve his odds of removing the pin marker. He failed his order. He actually removed his pin marker on his own, the lone Panzer Bukes. Uh, hit and then rolled a one, uh, so it just glanced off the front. These lads ate a whole bunch of, uh, they were just a ton of pin markers on them, so I was able to rally off uh, a couple of them. These guys over here, uh, they passed their test, unpinned, moved up, uh, fired. Uh, the P- the remaining Panzer Shrek, or Panzer Faust guy shot at the Bren gun carrier, missed. I didn't know you could shoot through enemy vehicles because he had moved his one lone guy on this side here, the Piet Gunner, yeah. Uh, so the rest of the Car 98s and the uh, MG34 killed him. Uh, yeah. Your armored car. Finally. Yeah, my armored car got finally got killed uh, by the Avery. Uh, so in the end, I mean, bad luck on... He had really bad luck. But as far as results, I think you've got... Yeah, results... Seven to two. Eight. Eight to two. Eight to two. He's got two of my units. Both the armored vehicles. Both the armored vehicles, yeah. The Spitfire and the um, Avery. I mean, these guys are on the cusp of breaking. Like I, Oh, yeah, I I passed the test there uh, when they initially took all those hits. <laughs> yeah. I, I rolled a four, yeah. yeah. Uh, so thanks for the game, Wade. Um, that was fun. Learned quite a lot. Um, the order in which you move when you do a snap to and your commander's where and kind of get a grips on that and point blank whether or not it's better to move or sit still like that's still the nuances that we've got to learn and um, I don't know if this was worth it the 7.5 I mean ultimately it took eons but it finally killed over there I'm just thinking this is the really it's only good for counter battery fire good against infantry yeah, but if there's ever an artillery piece like you have or an anti-tank gun, that, then this is going to be shooting at it, which yeah. is fine. I gotta say, I love those little Bren gun carriers. I mean, you couldn't, you couldn't pass any of your tests, but when you did, I mean, you're decimating dudes. Eight shots for seventy points. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. I'll have to see if there's anything similar for me. I mean, half tracks. Yeah, I'm paying eighty-nine points for a half track. It's only got one MMG. It carries twelve dudes. But it carries twelve dudes. But, I mean, who cares? That carries nothing. It's recce. It has two MMGs. Well, LMGs. Eight, or LMGs. Yeah. But still, that's eight shots. Eight shots. That's wild. Wild. All right, well, thanks for the game, man. Another good thing about yeah. it being recce is it not being a transport. It doesn't matter if I'm closer to your troops than mine. If it was a transport and you're oh, closer, yeah, you're it's right. automatic. Yeah, I forgot about that. So that's why you take the armor car slot for it as opposed to the transport. That's what, you know what? And, and I got one of his like that because I killed the infantry behind him and then... He was stuck, so I moved. I moved up, yeah, and I, I captured his brain gun carrier. Cool, man. Um, yeah, thanks for the game. Good game. Yeah, learned a lot. Thanks.